More than 70 fashion brands and designers including Dolce Gabbana, DKNY and Tommy Hilfiger are participating in the Metaverse Fashion Week or MVFW in which web avatars are being sent down the digital runway decked out in e-couture. To date, the people who are live now, for example, in Metaverse, uh, DKNY, Tommy Hilfiger, a whole bunch of other people. Um, StockX claims that they're, you know, have, they're selling NFTs of sneakers as well. The common practice is once a person takes possession of that, let's say uh, Tommy Hilfiger, and they go into the metaverse and buy a pair of jeans. And what they're doing is buying an NFT from Tommy Hilfiger. The event is being hosted by 3D virtual platform Decentraland and is running from Thursday through Sunday. It is of a piece with other arrivals for the fashion world in the crypto space, including the Meta Gala and the Crypto Fashion Week. Featured outfits are often being paired with the real life ones. Payments are taking place on the Boson Protocol Direct Commerce platform. And the premise, uh, the you know the the pr most of the people, they're buying a pair of jeans that they could put on their avatar, but they also get a, a similar pair that they redeem in, in their physical life. The early shows and displays at the MVFW have showcased the creative depth of participating designers. At an early show, DNG avatars were decked out in monochromatic one pieces featuring feline headgear and wing sets. Dress access avatars donned hologram based outfits. Participating designers see the event as fitting as world growing ever more remote. With the Mary J. Blige outfit that we did for the Super Bowl, you know, these outfits are these fantastical looks that people are never able to purchase and never able to try on. And we thought, well, how do we take this look and make it um, reachable for people to be able to, to wear them in a digital world? And that means you would be able to, so for a wearable, you're able to take a photo wearing, wearing the look that you'll be able to post to your social media. So, or, or wear in the metaverse. Within the metaverse, there is a, a virtual world called Decentraland. And within Decentraland, uh, there is a, a fashion week, metaverse fashion week, where many brands are um, exhibiting both digital and also using um, uh, Boson protocol, also uh, selling physical items within the metaverse. We have four bags available for sale for the first time in the metaverse, three Birkins and one Kelly bag. The first one is a 25 centimeter Birkin with palladium hardware, but it's a limited edition that however rare these are in the first place, um, Hermes made this beautiful red and white menagerie of their um, horses and all this other stuff hand painted and it's called the in and out biscuit. Um, that's a very special bag available. The second bag is one that there's a lot of hype because Cardi B was trying to track one down and we sold it to her, is a 35 centimeter Birkin and what they call is the cargo. It's made of canvas and leather trim and it's a very unorthodox thing. As you can see, there's all kinds of pockets on it, on the exterior. With Zoom, you know, we're here talking. At some point, all of us kind of got sick of having to dress up for Zooms or, you know, uh, people were wearing, you know, we've, we've all seen the videos of people in their boxers and, and, and dress shirts and jackets on. I think what will happen is at some point you'll say, okay, well, I have a Zoom and I don't want to get dressed up. Let's get, let's wear, I'll go into our digital closet and, and get a digital outfit that we can wear for this Zoom. Or we want to go into a metaverse party with our friends from all parts of the world. And what are we wearing to this? So you can actually say, oh, well, I have this in my physical closet that I really like. I want to wear that digital, the digital garment to the party. So you would almost have two sets. You would have a digital closet and a physical closet as well. But while digital fashion is allowing designers to push creative boundaries, the event and the crypto clothing space 
इट रिप्रेजेंट इन फैक्ट हैज अ डेमोक्रेटाइजिंग इफेक्ट ऑन फैशन अकॉर्डिंग टू डी सेंट्रल लैंड कम्युनिटी फाउंडर For a lot of users, it's their first NFT experience. They come into the central land. They don't even necessarily need a wallet. They come in as a guest, and then they see people wearing funky clothes and they're dressed in like the basic wearables, and they're like, "Hey, I want some of that." And while high-end fashion in the analog world is characterized by often unreachable prices, digital fashion has a different market place. They don't have to. have any money because there's so many wearables giveaways you know the the foundation does that in every big event we give away loads of free stuff so all they have to do is set up a wallet and they can go on one of these quests and get their first nft and then put it on and and express themselves uh in the world 